Hello everyone, semi-retired Bob here. I talk about the carnivore diet, all things related to the carnivore diet and miscellaneous odds and ends. Today is just a quick update video from what I talked about yesterday about listening to your body. No matter how good you feel, that first day back, I would suggest not overdoing it because I felt great. As you saw, I pushed myself to, I think it was about a mile and a half of walking that day. And then we got that snow squall that came in. It was late that night. So I went out because it was supposed to, it was 22 degrees. Then a snow squall came through. What a snow squall is in Nebraska is high winds, lots of snow in a big hurry. This thing only lasted about 40 minutes and we got two and a half, three inches of snow. And it was being driven down between 45 and 65 mile an hour winds. It was pretty brutal out there. But after it passed, I went out in the dark and ran the snow blower over everything because it was supposed to dip down into the severe minus temperatures and I didn't want all that snow to freeze into place. Um, I didn't get footage of that because it was dark out, but then the plows came through and that's what you're watching here. Me digging out the end of my driveway. It was cleaned out before, so this is just the total amount of crap that gets dumped into the end of my driveway from just a couple, three inches of snow. I never did hear exactly how much it was, but because they come down the street and dump stuff into my driveway, and then they come down that road across the way, and as they turn the corner, more crap gets dumped into the end of my driveway. There's, you know, well, as you can see, I'm struggling with this here. I had to go out and I had to go get my, uh, my chopper to chop the stuff up into small enough chunks that the snowblower would grab it and throw it away. Um, one of the things I forgot to talk about in the live stream that I'm going to talk about very briefly here, John, you know who you are. Thank you very, very much. John went out to my Amazon page and sent me a thing of salt, a thing of coffee, a new cutting board, and some uh, scrubby pad sponge thingies. But thank you very, very much, John. I was in dire need of a new cutting board because you guys have all seen my cutting board. I actually got the exact same one in again. But I've been eating my meat off of that for pretty close to a year. And what doesn't show up in the cameras because I use it so much it's starting to get little cracks and splinters in it. And I don't want to add fiber to my diet that way. So getting a brand new cutting board as a gift from John was fantastic. Thank you again very, very much, John. I really appreciate you and everyone that has ever sent me anything on my Amazon, from my Amazon wish list. I appreciate all of you. Those of you that are channel members, Thank you very much. That little bit of support really means an awful lot to me. I want to thank each and every one of you. I wish I had time to name you all by name. As you can see, I'm still working. So what I'm going to do now is play some music and let you watch the rest of this clip of me clearing out my driveway from all of the crap the street guys dumped into it. I hope you enjoyed this quick little video. Don't forget, get out there, be 1% better. Day, tomorrow, every day. And don't forget, listen to your body. And the very next day after a, after a feeling off day, maybe take it a little easier than I did. Have a great day, folks.